Medvedev's really good. good oh na nowadays it's actually pretty easy Mednafen made it way way better like it's 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 yep, basically perfect I uh, yeah that's what i use i use uh the Mednafen that doesn't have the uh oh i'm dumb yeah you gotta press start to pick your shit yeah. yes i just realized i'm stupid and press an a like a moron there we go yep. thunderdome jesus what kind of thunderdome well, we'll get beyond Thunderdome. Let's ride the train. Do you think it's possible you could like chain like on a oh. on a future oh update my God. on it? I like could... I don't know. Are we fighting? Shit. We are definitely fighting. Okay. I am the Shredder. I will dine on turtle soup. No, don't do that. That's me. Char charge times are pretty short in this game, so uh, don't yeah. be afraid to go for charge moves. Oh, there we go. Here. I was actually gonna ask if it's possible to can like Michelangelo's uh, anti-air move. I was thinking, like, would it be possible to change that to like a Shoryuken button input instead of the charge? Because it's way awkward like that to be. Cool. Yeah, charge characters are, are different. I mean, there's no question, but there's always an advantage innately to not having to choose a direction for your anti-air. Like, uh, think of it this way. If you have to do a DP, you have to make sure you do your DP in the correct direction. If you do down up, it just goes the direction that it's supposed to go. True. So that, that that's that's part of the reason it actually makes it much better. Like you'd think innately having full control over it would be good enough, but actually not having to know where the person is is even better. Right, because especially they can they can get they can jump over you real quick during a frame transition. Mm -hmm. You 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 drop the Hadouken or whatever. Exactly. Can... Got him, Pat. <laughs> it's just a bunch of uppercuts. Raph, Raph is extremely strong. His fireball is really, really good, too. I like Michelangelo a lot in this game. Mike is really good. Extremely, extremely good. The only thing is you gotta, uh, you gotta make sure you land that, um, that Blanca Ball move he has. It's very powerful. Like, if you catch oh, yeah. that fully, you can get, like, a oh, free no. stun, and you can just do it again. It does, like, 85, 90% of their health. Oh yeah, I've even done it to where like I would I would clip through them and get behind. Oh, oh my god, I stopped blocking. What move was that? My super. That's a super. Yeah. Oh wow, but that's crazy. When you get uh, low on health, you build super even faster, so you kind of have to avoid the other person, or else you'll give the meter. Yeah. yeah your meter also drains the longer you don't land hits. Right, round it, it, two. It's interesting. There's not many games that have draining meter. Round two. I'll stick with him. I'll stick with my boy Raph. How how do you feel about the general uh, uh, colors? Like, have there been any that you just didn't like, or any suggestions? Because we are looking for suggestions oh, wow. for colors. I, I love them because they're all weird and nonsense colors. I I love I love it when colors get stupid. It's funny, so I'm I'm okay with them. <laughs> colors the get big, stupid. Oh, it's a half the, circle. I'm stupid. The big thing to remember is like a lot of these actually are references. Like the person who made these colors was very very into Ninja Turtles and put a lot of like deep hidden lore in these colors. It's it's. It's funny, like, I see what you're saying about, like, they're just, like, off the wall. They're definitely not what you would expect for a Ninja Turtles game, that's for sure. Oh, totally, like, like that's why I say I like using the flesh-colored Michelangelo. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I see, yeah, I... I was gonna say, do you guys have, like, just a straight black and white as an original reference to the comics? Yeah, uh, well, okay, so... Uh, the guy who made our colors, uh, a gentleman by the name of Koshe, he uh, he's big into keeping things accessible for like the colorblind. So technically, we could put like 100% black and white and it would be no problem whatsoever. But for the sake of making it so that people who maybe have like, you know, sight issues are able to play the game, they're like slightly more gray and, and like bluish. You'll see, if you switch through the colors, every single character has uh, like, it's like a grayish blue and black color and it, it looks like a comic book and they have a red highlight oh you'll see you'll see it's okay. awesome yeah, they're, everyone's got a shitload of colors i love it yeah that that was my number one goal with this game back in the day when i complained about not having enough colors i was like you know i could get over like the colors being not that great if there was like three or four of them at least so you could mix it up and the, i guess you know it was just one of those things we met someone who was like I can make 12 colors for every character in the game. And they did it in like a, a two days. Like, a, a, it was ridiculous. <laughs> oh, 
oh, shit. props to them because, like, like I said, I love I oh. love a lot of them just because of how nonsense they are. Wait, wait till you see. Uh, uh, there's some stuff planned for the new one that's gonna be. It's we're we're going really outside of the box and trying to like make some stuff that's not anything like what we had previously. Um, you remember how in some of the old like covers of the Ninja Turtles comics, the turtles all wore red bandanas? You ever thought of giving everyone a, a red bandana variant? Just yeah, we we have one. That's what I was just talking. Oh, well, really? you'll, you'll see. You'll see. You'll see. After this match, you you guys got to go back to the color select. I'm gonna help yeah. you see the vision of these colors and Great. see why. Because I, I like I said, they're all a lot of them are actually references. I'll just show you the uh, the comic book one for right now. But if you do see a color you like, just let me know and I'll tell you if there's a story behind it. All right. I'm just waiting for them to get done so that way I can join Jesus. and hopefully fight. Jesus. Oh, uh, this is clutch. Shred Shredder's jumping light punch is really strong. Very, very good. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> good you. GG. See Shredder. All right, let me see if I can finally get JoJo in here. Is there any reason right. why he's Cyber Shredder in this game? Uh, I think the lore from the game is that it has something to do with uh, Turtles in Time. Uh, I don't know for sure. This game was called TMNT 5, so that would make it seem like it's kind of like at least after Hyperstone Heist. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I, it, it's 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 uh, a um, Cyber Shredder is the final form of Shredder from uh, uh, oh, Turtles in Time, right? I mean, I'm not crazy. That's that is correct, right? Or um, I'm having the same problem. I can only change colors, and I can't use the D-pad. I might need to go. You might need to go to the input settings. That your way your set stuff is bored, Jojo. <laughs> Hell no, I tell you. <laughs> yeah, woo! I can move. I'm alive. Oh fuck! What the? I keep forgetting the stupid <laughs> the stupid X button is the one that exits out the menu. It's okay. I did it three times in a row. It's so confusing. Okay, so so you saw that uh, that one color that was a. Uh, if you keep going again, keep going. A little mm. more, a little more. You're so close to the, the color. That one. That's oh the God. comic book color. That's got Me the red headband oh. and everything. Right. And everyone has one of those, so. I'm, I'm gonna use flesh tone, Mikey. Just to freak <laughs> everybody out. Flesh tone. So, sorry about that. I am so sorry about that, everyone watching, and I am also sorry, Ren. I'm probably gonna so cut long. all of that out until we actually start fighting. It there just makes go. the most sense. Yeah. Dragon breath. Why is Mikey's projectile him belching? Is my question. I, possibly pizza related. Hate <laughs> a, a, a nuclear pizza. Oh my god, what is that? <laughs> I'm, he knows I'm just not I'm, Anything could happen. I'm just, I'm just glad they had fun with this game, you know? Yeah. I did that video where I played the Genesis version too, and I was like, man, this game stinks. <laughs> yeah, the, play the NES version one of these days. That's that's probably the worst one. I wouldn't doubt it. I wouldn't doubt it. Wait, this game was on the normal NES? Normal yeah. NES was one of the last games on the console. Yep, it was on NES, Super Nintendo, Genesis, and I think there was a Game Boy version. It could be wrong. Oh boy! <laughs> it actually, uh, it actually got really popular in Russia. There's a, a huge Russian uh, Ninja Turtles Tournament Fighters NES scene. Actually, really? it's they've hacked the game and like they've added a whole bunch of stuff to it. Uh, we're actually helping them set up uh, new colors. So you're going to be able to have like 12 different colors of the characters in that game. <laughs> no. Wow. Now, you remember that ROM hack of this game called Kart Fighter and it's like Mario characters and... Yeah, of course. Yeah, Kart isn't Fighter. That, uh... Isn't that... Wasn't that like made from Ninja the Ninja Turtles fighting game on NES as a base? So there's, there is a, a, like a, a, a bootleg wiki that talks about where it comes from. I don't know a ton about that game specifically, but I know that, you know, that engine, the one for Kart Fighter, is used on like almost every uh, yeah. NES fighting game, like all the bootlegs. Not the all way. of them, but a, a lot of yeah. them. Like Yeah, the way Chinese bootlegs work is you make <laughs> one, you make one game and then you make 20 other games based off it. Oh yeah, yeah. that's why, that's why like in the bootleg scene, there's like Street Fighter 25 or something. Or... <laughs> Street Fighter 4 was on the NES. What? Yeah. Are you kidding? It, it was. Yeah. Yeah, it definitely was. Wow. You order those carts from like like those what was that like those weird Chinese websites like Wish and stuff. Yeah. I always want to do it, but I'm just like. Mm. Oh, you should buying buying uh, a cart from AliExpress. I bought a uh, Truxton, uh, and uh, I bought a uh, World Heroes for Genesis. 
Yeah, the only thing I bought from AliExpress is I bought. Oh, fuck. They have like a bunch of Legos of like licensed properties that you would like never see, like Dragon Ball <laughs> Legos, and there oh, there's yeah. some um, Warhammer 40k ones of the Guardsmen. I'm like, you, Ooh, that you would be can. Cool. You can I, you can get them. You can get them from already, AliExpress. You've already talked yourself into this. I don't know why you haven't pulled the trigger. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm trying not to spend all my money, you know. <laughs> I can't I can't have it be like my actual Warhammer figures where I have like 20 boxes sitting over there on. Painted currently. Oh God! I'm just trying to imagine having 20 boxes worth oh, of, of Warhammer Lego figures. Oh man! I gotta, I gotta, I gotta retrofit all of them. I gotta make a Cadian unit. I gotta make a Catachan unit. You know, a I mean, kind of the whole point. If you're, if you're, if you're playing uh, Warhammer and you're not making sculptures, probably not doing it right. That's like the orc philosophy, man. You just buy something random and then just glue some stuff to it and call it an orc vehicle. Oh my God. <laughs> You get yourself like a model train set, paint it yellow, put some orcs on it, boom. New orc vehicle right there. Flex. Is that guy like throwing got, money into a can? You got your tickets to the show, you got your tickets to the gun show right here. Uh, the way War poses when he wins. He's fucking scaly. I've never yep. seen this guy in the cartoon though. I know Me Wing neither. Who is. is this guy? War's from the Archie comics run of TMNT. Oh, okay. Armageddon and Wingnut Wing were pretty Nut. prominent in those two. I did yeah, a lot of research for my video. <laughs> Wingnut and Screwloose, I remember them in the com- I actually have- used to have the- the comic. Like, when I was a little kid, I had these comics that came with, like, cassette tapes you could follow along with, and Wingnut and Leatherhead was in- Why wasn't wow. Leatherhead in this game? I mean, yeah, why wasn't Leatherhead in at least one of them? Yeah, Leatherhead was, oh. I think he was in the NES version, I think. Nah, he's the, it's like a completely random character just like him, but not him. Oh. I, yeah, exactly. <laughs> you're just like, you're like, what, why is he not in? Oh, uh, there's just someone exactly like him that's in? Great. That's, that's awesome. <laughs> is it a rights thing or something? It maybe could have been. I mean, let's, let's be real. It's the NES version of Tournament Fighters. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> just kind of threw it on there to make a couple extra dollars, you know? All right, I, I'm gonna... I, I have infinite respect for the, uh, the, the the hack, but the original version, maybe not my favorite NES game. Just to interrupt, right. I, I have to discard my turn. I'm going to let you guys uh, fight it out. All right. You, you want, uh, want me to connect then? or? Uh, yeah, you can fight with someone else. Uh, Riot, you want to fight? Yeah, sure. Okay. Rip PS, the Super Nintendo controller. Apparently, Parsec doesn't want me to use on this thing. Next, we'll get Pretty 80s. Bizarre. All right, that sounds good to me. Yeah, but that uh, that NES hack, it's called um, yeah. Tournament Fighters Beyond. Uh, they, they, like I said, they they've done a lot to that game. Surprisingly, they've rebalanced it. They've they've added new stages. They've yeah, it's. <laughs> Not your standard ROM hack for a fighting game where it's just like, oh, we'll add cheats or something like that. It's like, no, we've, we've added like completely new content, tag team mode, all sorts of stuff. I like this color for Dawn. I think those are in the game by default because you do fight like a clone of yourself in like the story mode that's just purple. Or no, that's a way deeper one. Never mind, I was wrong. <laughs> well, we do we do have clone palettes. That was that. I mean, obviously, as you pointed out in the game, you fight against uh, evil versions of yourself. So we kind of tried to put those versions of the turtles in the game as well. Now I'm not. Mu I don't really know much about ROM hacking, so forgive me. This question sounds really stupid, but is it possible to like add new character, like hack this to add new characters to this game while keeping the original roster intact or no? Yeah, uh, I mean at this point, we, uh, our uh, our game, you know, Championship Edition uh, I, I work on that game exclusively just because it's it's one of those it's one of those passion projects for me. I always wanted to see this game get an update that was just literally let's add colors and do stuff like that uh, and then there's another, uh, I'm a part of a team and the other part of the team for right now they've been focusing on kind of like the, the theory behind it uh, but they're going to be adding in a whole bunch of new content. Like, oh it's a ludicrous amount of content that's planned. And they've got a lot of stuff already made. They're just trying to get to the point where the game is something that they understand enough to be able to hack it. Surprisingly, uh, Tournament Fighters is actually a very complicated game. Uh, so, yeah, this game's hard. Well, 
<laughs> exactly. The game itself, very difficult, but it, like actually like disassembling it and uh, changing things, there's a lot of like intricate parts to the way the game runs that if you try to mess with them, it can, it can cause some serious issues, which is why it's taken as long as it has to do what we've already accomplished. <laughs> Right, I can believe that. So who won, Rad or uh, Jojo? Uh, I no, I lost. Okay. That is 1-0 okay. for now. Let me see. I started to like Donnie in this game. Here, let me go back to Mike. He had a lot of fun with You know, Mike. Leo or Raph is not bad. Like, I, I can see why. I think Hades said he was top tier, Raph. Uh, Raph is Raph. definitely top tier, yeah. Yeah, he's like the best turtle in the game, I can say that much. Just because he's like Chestbuster, having the invincibility on it and the body press and everything, he's just got a very good tool set the, overall. The corkscrew attack, which is like hold back and then forward punch. Also, yeah. M. Bison, got it. Yeah. M. Bison, he's got the scissor kicks and everything, I just realized. <laughs> yeah. See, there's Psycho Crusher. He's, he's Bison with a fireball before... That was a thing. <laughs> so, was there any lore to explain why the turtles can suddenly shoot energy in this game or no? Uh, okay, so this has been a question in the community for years. So I'm going to address this only because I feel like uh, it really is something that's, that's happened in, in the, the chat. We've decided that for this game, they just kind of have powers in this universe at this point. Like, they've gone through time, they've done all this stuff, and they've learned how to be able to do this. This is like the latest that you get for the turtles in like the video game canon. So like that's that's why they have all those abilities. They normally wouldn't, but they just are that well trained. Uh, in uh, TMNT Cross Justice League, we actually explained it by saying um, there's this thing called the Omega Force and it, it powers people up so they have superpowers that they wouldn't normally have. But you're 100% you're right. It's so out of nowhere. It's like, why are they suddenly shooting fireballs? They don't do that in the comics ever <laughs> right like i'm thinking like i'm thinking like maybe this is like if if tmnt was somehow japanified because i looked at the move list in the game on game faqs and like a lot of the names for the moves are like japanese words and shit okay. <laughs> okay, Rising that's two against me all right so next up is mr hades let me get you in all right, okay let me, let me connect will i still be able to watch at least or uh, I think you'll uh, unless you want me to court. fight unless you want me to fight Hades, I'll I'll take him on. You can. I've had a, I've had four turns already. Be my guest. All right, I'll take him on. Uh, let me get my controller plugged in. Yep, I I have it set for this PS4 pad, so hopefully that'll work for whatever you're gonna plug in. But but if you but if you have to reset it, well, I I did it, so it's possible. Let's see what happens first, though. Yeah, let's hope nothing explodes. It seems good. good. Yeah, we're good. All right. Let's see. What do we got? I'll try right, King... Let me know when you guys have started so I can at least come in and watch. Right. Right here. I'll play as King Shark. Why not? <laughs> oh, get in my lap already. Come on. Oh, what the hell? On, kitty cat. My cat is being a bum, and I'm, I'm annoyed. <laughs> Just, just throw a treat in the hallway and he'll leave you alone. Oh god, I said the T word. No, my cat's looking at me. My, my cat only understands like four words. I no definitely treat and food. I definitely never played as this dude. The the shark guy plays a lot like Guile. Also, he's a charge character. Yeah, he's he's charge down, up and kick, and charge back, forward punch. Those are the big ones. Sonic Boom and the Flip Kick. That that shark can basically do them. Only he shoots his Sonic Boom Whoa. out of his mouth. Oh, you're right about that. Oh. God damn it, Ariel. Come on, jump. Yeah. Come on. Said, uh, hopefully jump in a future this. update, you can turn Mikey's anti-air into like a Dragon Punch button combo. Oh man. It'd be cool if you had both. That would be that would be kind of a cool idea. There you go, like an alternate input. There you go. Round two. Fight. Yeah. Oh, Hopefully no. my stuff from Amazon gets here today. Ah. Oh, okay, he has that, which is a giant throw for some reason. Uh, oh no. 
uh, just remember charge times are really short like you can you can throw a fireball like <laughs> basically like a second it's nice oh, oh my god i want to do that i just noticed i'm able to watch on the discord chat I didn't, I didn't notice that was going on till now that's how i've been watching it via discord get round three fight that was a bad move but yeah, see, this game would have been so cool to have Casey Jones and Leather and Leatherhead in them. That's what I'm talking about. Like, where is yeah. Casey Jones? Yep. He's in the Genesis version, Ren. No. He's yeah, in the Genesis version. So is April O'Neil trained by Vega. So, <laughs> Hold you know, on. Got April O'Neil in air quotes. Yep. <laughs> April O'Neil. Blaze Fielding. Let's just be real with ourselves here. Ow. Okay. What? The only newscaster I know that wears a full yellow bodysuit to work every day, and she's not in combat. Or <laughs> that moves dumb. All right, one for me. I don't know who I'm gonna pick next. Hmm. Make sure you uh, make sure you take a look at the colors before you pick. I'm I'm, I'm sorry. It's like a small. It's a small thing. I pre I would appreciate. It's like, it's always fun to look at the colors. I always try to find a funny color. Oh my god, that was that a was that a mango sentinel? <laughs> yes, that is mango sentinel. <laughs> okay. Do it, do it, do oh, it. Oh shit, there it is. Oh wow, dude. <laughs> oh, I'm dumb. Start. I pressed A again. Oh no, I'm lost oh, now. Comic, comic Raphael is I mean, or Leonardo. Okay. Leonardo looks so. You ever notice how Leonardo's avatar? He looks so pissed. <laughs> Yeah. He's like the one turtle you don't really see get pissed very much. He's channeling Raph, so he'll be alright. He's channeling his inner Raph. Oh, there's a, there's another character that would have been cool. Baxter Stockman with his flying crap. Behold my dog. Whatever you do, moment. don't look at his groin. I already saw. I already saw. Oh, God. God damn it. <laughs> you guys are crazy. He's loving this turtle beat down. Little too much. I guess. <laughs> oh, by the way, did you make Endless Screw not suck? Uh, in a uh, uh, Justice League, uh, TMNT Cross Justice League, yes, it is a way better move. Uh, yeah, because this is this is just an aesthetic done. thing. So unfortunately, like uh, uh, it is one of those things where it comes down to like we can't really make changes to the game. We yeah. just improve the content that's there, basically. Uh, yeah. <laughs> if no you want, if you want a new game, I can I can tell you a new game that's got all this stuff too. But what the fuck? <laughs> Yeah, no big old balance yeah, patch. Yeah, what I was telling you all, you know, TMNT Cross Justice League is really the sequel to this game. If you oh. if you like this game, but maybe feel like you are missing certain content, you know, like Casey Jones, you could play Cross Justice League, and it has that stuff. So. Oh shit! Nice. Oh god. And let's screw. Why can't I do my pile driver like a smart person? You said pile driver. I am trying so hard not to choke, but that, yep. that makes me so happy. I, I played Leo, and the only reason you endless screw is for stun. Yeah, it, it is. It is unfortunately not even good as like a movement option because it's so obvious. Yep, yeah, and all you got to do is you can really just crouch and it doesn't even touch you. Ex yeah, exactly. <laughs> I mean, that can be good. That can be tricky, but it's just too slow to be used that way, unfortunately. Oh, Ultron. It's funny, that's supposed to be the comic book color for Chrome Dome, but when oh. you said Ultron, I totally get that, though. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I, now, I now that you pointed it out, I can't unsee Literally, it. Literally, that's where my <laughs> mind went to. <laughs> Turns out I'm a huge oh, dork. He's playing, he's playing Lime Gelatin Raph here. <laughs> Lime Gelatin? <laughs> yeah, look at that color. Like, so, uh, so picture this, but with uh, Cyrax or Sector colors, and that's really what I was I was thinking for for uh, his with the color I'm working on for him. You're gonna give him all the colors of all the of all the ninjas in Mortal Kombat. Oh my God, <laughs> your leg! Fuck off! Behold, I am Delson. <laughs> he, feel, he feels like a Cyrax in my mind. Like his the way he plays, he's more like a Cyrax than a Sector. He's not like shooting projectiles out of his chest. He, he, just has, he has the ground wave like Kasumi he's, Goto. And he's got a grab, just like, you know, that's how Cyrax is, too, so. 
I wish I could. I wish I was better at doing it up down. Oh, it's a down up light punch and light kick. Oh, it, light. Oh, God, I'm trying to press heavy. Yeah, that's that special is very good. If, uh, if you could use it after a person blocks too. So like if you uh, if you get like a, oh you you I, you know what I'm not gonna say anything. I, this match is not a good match. That's all I'm gonna say. It's not a good match for me because I'm eating knees. I might have this one. Wow, that screw oh is really God. good. Ugh. Yeah, Raph is Raph is really fun. You ever see Michelangelo's super move in this game? It's like a KOF like barrage. Yeah, it's pretty. Oh. It's pretty awesome. So like when I do it, sometimes I like to like like go out 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 like uh like <laughs> Rio Sakazaki. It's definitely Goro. got uh it's definitely got some Rio Rio or, vibes to it. Or maybe just 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 be a turd and go ora ora ora. Oh my God. The lows, or man. Muda, muda. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. So that throw punch. is the, the the best the best option that Chrome Dome has in this match. I, I I that throw is really good. The slam or the one where he grabs you and punches you a couple times. The one where he grabs you and punches you uh, punches you a couple times. Oh. Oh, you almost have meter. No. Both of you, both of I'm you have, yeah. No, I'm joking. There you go, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, I, I think you just ran out of meter. You were real close to having it. Yeah, let's press a button so it work. I was like, you know what? I might as well just try it, and it worked. And, he, uh. and apparently Raphael can throw fireballs now. In yeah, air. like, what is the deal with these moves? Like, these turtles it's could not do this before. It's like Japanese TMNT, I guess. Minus the mechas. Like anime TMNT. Wait, there was mechas and Japanese Ninja Turtles? I hope so. I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, that's my turn done. So who All else right, wants I'll to play? I'll connect, I guess. All right, Jojo. I guess you could fight Hades and then Rad Raz next. Yeah. OK. All right. Yeah, the first thing I thought seeing that super was like he's throwing meatballs at him or something like something weird is going on. You can tell there's uh, the uh, Shoto colors and then there's like uh, Rachel. There's a couple. There's a couple of references in here. I have a gold. I have a gold Michelangelo. I pr should probably use this one. That one is pretty good. Gold Mike. Oops, Try my ask. bad. My bad. My uh, bad. The mistake happened again. I've done it. We've Start all done button. it now. It's okay. I pressed, I pressed B. That was my fault. I'm sorry. <laughs> Remember, this is the I, 90s. You gotta press. It's one of those games where you gotta press start. Oh, look at me. I'm a <laughs> from the 90s. Oh, you wanna press that A button? No, you gotta press start. <laughs> it could be worse. It could be circle is like the start button. We don't believe in this any button philosophy. We know what button you want to use to start the game. <laughs> oh no, this is a PS4. Yeah, the best stage. It's options. Oh, okay. It's options now. It's Jeez. options. Oh, still Baxter with a hard on. Okay. That's yep. Serious. Leave him. He's having this, a good time. This little fly pecker right there. <laughs> what? <laughs> Where? Ugh. Where am I? This is for this is for this is for cheating in the Chun Li oh. versus my death battle. My oh, oh wait, you're not my. There's, oh, there's your boy Casey wow. on the right. Yeah, he's just, he's just, just up throw it the up there. there. He's like, yeah, go, go, uh, really sick looking Michelangelo. Yeah, better me than you. Put that one on my. Oh. 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 Is that like an evade? Yeah, Michelangelo's got some good evade. Wow. Like he's real like he can be hard to hit because he's got that he's got that flip move that's like Blanca's like little rolling tackle thing. Oh, I think all the turtles have the back roll. You know, you know this? Everybody's right got there. the Oh. Interesting. Oh, yeah. That's the other thing. Uh because when I do that with Raphael, it's the screw move. It's like a dragon punch. Yep. Oh, she's got a DP. It's just random spin, DPs. But... Hey, I don't know how to play this character, all right? Except this guy's DP is a down up move, like like the flip kick. What the fuck? People gotta be a little less confused with how they name these moves, or not name them, say these moves. Oh no. 
Asuka is really good at, at, at doing uppercuts, as you notice. So it's not always necessary to go in with her. She she is really good at uppercutting. Yeah, just like dude. Oh, God, it's like we got to figure out. All right, let's kick show. Yeah, Michelangelo is really fun. I like him. He's my favorite turtle so far in this game. Also, this game's got some really good music, I gotta say. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, uh, I cannot say the same for the AI. Yeah. It happened again. That, that, that was me. me. That, wasn't that was me. me this time, I admit that. <laughs> I'm so eager. Let's push a button. All right. Let's see. Uh, uh, let's, let's go red. Red, blue, the inverted Raphael. Let's see, huh? It's a good color combo to go with. I like this. I like blue. I like blue. The ice blue. Okay, Cyber Sub Zero. <laughs> yeah, I, I see. I can see it. You are not so fierce. Round one. Fight. Oh yeah, we yeah. gotta play MK9 on Steam sometime. I think the servers for it are still up. But we gotta play a Mortal. They took it down though, didn't they? The movie's coming out. Yes. Absolutely. Yeah, they, they took it off of Steam, but you can still play. I think the servers for it are still <sighs> online. I, I do have it. Game and it was on Steam. Ah. We did play it like offline for par second. I thought it ran decently, so should be good. Yeah. yeah. I bring out my old striker, my old awful striker play. Uh, just roll. <laughs> Basically, I actually made smoke in that game. It's the most random maining of all time. I think I made yeah, him I made, as well. I made smoke. I made smoke and Cabal in that game. Well, Cabal is the best character in the game. So. Oh yeah. Cabal. I'm also kind of good with Johnny Cage in that game. All the tech in MK9 was so busted. That was the best part about it, I think. It had some uh, impressively broken shoes to fill after Mortal Kombat Trilogy. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> after the 3D games. <laughs> Mortal Kombat Armageddon. Oh, I say man. that as a... I actually like that game a little bit. I understand its flaws, but I I, I can enjoy it. Right, a piece of shit can be fun, you know. Oh yeah. Mortal Kombat Armageddon is extremely deep. I'm bad. But it's also really not very good. Oh, <laughs> it's the only fighting game that's got a fighting game. What is that guy doing with his hand in the background? I have no what idea. What is this Captain Falcon gentleman doing? Oh, look what he's doing. It's a lion out in Captain Falcon's clothing. Jacking off ghosts, I guess. I don't know. Okay, and who's the who's the is that Dingle? Oh. Is that Dingle from 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 Zelda? Dingle's wife. I remember her from the cartoon. Oh fuck. That's oh, she was like that alien that like came from Dimension X that drove a flying car or something. I and must have like, missed this one. It was like one of the first episodes of the cartoon. Yeah, it's an early one. Like episode three, I think. The uh the neutrino. Yeah. That? What are he's doing? Suggesting something? Ow, I'm, I'm dead. He's like, winner goes out back. Woo. I, and, the, and those Mausers in the fort. I in the love back. the Mausers getting hype. They're, look at how happy they are. They're they're thrilled. They're for, doing for, a jig. For for robots that that are programmed to hunt mice, they're pretty they're pretty happy. I'm I'm glad they could obtain sentience long enough to enjoy this fight. I think this is the tiebreaker. Yeah. Alright, uh, so stick with what, I, what I'm what i good with. Yeah, I'll stick the only character I actually learned how to play properly. And I won't press A this time. <laughs> I'll play as, I'll play as uh, Barney the Dinosaur Michelangelo here. <laughs> Barney the Dinosaur? Just look at him. Look at him. I love you. Oh, that, that reminds me, like... In a future update, you should like give Mikey this color, but like change his shell to be gr to be green, so it look just like Barney. <laughs> I too am liking Phoenix Suns Michelangelo. <laughs> Phoenix what? The Phoenix Suns, their basketball team. Oh, we're not sports people apparently. Uh, <laughs> Uncultured well, swine. Like NBA Jam a lot. NBA Jam is like my favorite sports game. I'll play the shit out of that. Yeah, you know, I'll admit it. Yes, a couple days ago I was playing a uh, backyard baseball like in rules. Dude, like action sports games were awesome. I'm so appalled that there's like less of them now. I know, man. Red. 
Backyard baseball isn't an action sports game. It's a, a baseball game meant for children. How, what? Well, right, I think I heard of that before, actually. So. I was going to say, if you've never played backyard baseball, man, give it a shot sometime. It's actually super fun. You can get it on a backyard football as a kid. Just play. Maybe it's on my abandonware. It's so much fun. Just, just draft a good team. Yes. Draft. What was his name? Pablo Lopez. Just make sure to draft him. You'll win every game. Uh, just play MLB Slugfest where you can you know, set yourself you know on fire. You know what I might do one of these days since we're talking about NBA Jam? Like do a Parsec session of the Saturn version of NBA Jam and just play against my Charlotte Hornets. That's, well, that's the team I like. I, w I was going to say we kind of already did, but we didn't do the Saturn version, so yeah. I got the Saturn version. Yep, I've got the, I got Medefen running that game beautifully. Couple of knees here. No good! He's on fire! That voice takes me back. Came back for that newish one that came out a couple of years ago, so that was nice. That was like on the 360 or something? You're talking about Yeah, that? I have that one. It's, not, oh, it's pretty nice. fun. I'm... Oh my god. Yeah, I like how that little flip move clears so much, clears like so much space. Like it gets all the way to the other side of the screen if uninterrupted. <laughs> All right, it's time for me to fight Mr. Rad, and then we're All gonna right. move on. Okay. All right, so go ahead and kick me, I guess. Just kick me to to the curb where I belong. <laughs> oh, let's see here. Let me throw it to, to the ground. To watch it. There we go. I want you guys to pick the fun, like the weirdest color, just the weirdest color you can find for your character. Like I, most, I'm on board with that too. Like the most nonsense color that goes with your character, like uh, like a pink, like a bright, like a bright pink, uh, freaking shredder or something. That even mm, that looks pretty weird. There. Or Mac shredder. There you go, purple shredder. <laughs> this is as close as it is, silver shredder. <laughs> That is that oh. is similar to the all white costume. I didn't even think about that that before. That is actually very similar to that concept. Ooh, that is a cool looking blue for Leo there. Deep blue Leo. I don't know. That's like a blueberry taking diarrhea or something. I have no idea. <laughs> that profile picture does not help. Tim after eating that uh that one candy from uh, Willy Wonka, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. I can't. I wish I remembered that movie better because I love the original. Oh really my Wonka. god. I have not watched that movie in like decades. I oh, am man. getting shredded. I still sometimes I creep around work seeing there's no earthly way of knowing god, which direction we're going. Now. No okay. one knows what I'm talking about because no! I'm old. I should have capitalized. No, right through projectiles. Jesus. Oh, okay. get in. Boomer here. Holy crap. <laughs> I'm at work. So I work with a bunch of young people. Not, not in the, not here. We're all, we're all. Commit that to memory. Sure. That's new for me. Yep, I, I turned 36 not too long ago, actually. Oh you God. old boomer. Yeah, I just I'm turned old. 29, and I forgot how old I was the other day. Damn kids, get off my lawn. Uh, you damn, you damn kids with your DLCs and your water bottles and your DRMs and your MP3 oh. players and your oh. your golf clubs and your working plumbing <laughs> and your video games that don't have blood in them. Some that do have bunch. blood in them. I mean, oh. your total wars that have blood. <laughs> oh my oh God! God. <laughs> what was that? In the rain in there. Holy shit! I, I love that Shredder is just Balrog in this game. It's it's it's, he's it's great. Balrog with he's Balrog with lightning powers and a reflect for some reason. I love it's it. It's great. Just cut when you make your fighting games. Just just cut loose, you know. Just anything right, is else? fine. What else is there? It's like I was gonna say, no one's played like Wingnut. Red. Wingnut looks really really high in this thing. Look look, look at him. With a it's name a like that, I'm not surprised. Where is the? There's the cafeteria. That's my favorite stage. Yeah. Oh, wing, wing, Love the nuggets. Oh, nuggets. Wingnut got a bad case of the munchies, so he came down to this cafeteria, even though it's a diner. I think I had a chicken leg. I was like, oh, there's me. There's me in the background eating a chicken leg, watching two people fight. I, I like. I love when fighting game stages are just like really active in the background. It's the best. They got a dog back there. 
I'm gonna play some like weirder fighting games later. I'm gonna play like Kaiser Knuckle at some point in my life. You, if you want to play a weird fighting game, get on get on the Saturn and play a uh, rabbit. He is no match for Shredder. Let me write that down. Saturn it's, rabbit. Yep, it's it's a 2D fighting game that was released only in Japan, and uh, oh. it's pretty weird. It's pretty. It's a funny. It's a it's a good playing game. It's just the visuals are really really weird. Yeah, the weirder the better, I say. Uh, I was thinking about Kaiser Knuckle because uh, Justin Wong uploads random arcade playthroughs on his YouTube channel, and he played Kaiser Knuckle. It has like breakaway stages and stuff. I'm like, mm, that seems interesting. Okay, that was a cool move, but Jesus! One. This dude's crushing your quads, man. What are you gonna do? The stuffing. I'm gonna crush his shins. Oh, oh yeah, I could vape indoors. So yeah, I could I could hit this TH. Was that guy wearing a Chicago Bulls shirt? Uh, which one? <laughs> it really does look like it. The guy in the black tank top. He's guy. wearing like a Chicago Bulls shirt. The oh, guy on the yeah, left. The bald guy, I see. It does look like a Chicago Bulls shirt. <laughs> All right, that's two for me. All right, let's swap out to Hades. Oh, Lord. To embarrass myself again. Let's see, where are you, sir? There we go. I'm connected. Is War like a Triceratops or something? I think he's just like a mutant, isn't he? Mutant or an alien or something? Oh yeah, this this is good. Yeah, the only other so it's like like I said, I only used to watch the cartoon. I know some of these are from the comics. These characters. I'm really gonna add Usagi Yojimbo. That's the question. Is that the rabbit guy? That's like a samurai. Yeah, yeah. it's like his own his own like comic series. Usagi Yojimbo. Oh. Uh, that has crossed over with TMNT because it just I guess makes too much sense. I don't know. I think that's a good way to explain it. <laughs> hey, if it's if it's, a, if it's an animal person that knows martial arts, it can cross over just fine. Like Sisyphus from uh, Genesis Tournament Fighters. Oh no! Surprised, I'm surprised we didn't see like an actual street shark in some sort of like fighting game. Oh my god. Oh, I just realized I had beater. I was like, "Ooh, bash it!" That magic just, pixel. Yeah. Beep boop. Code spark. Maybe Let's someone can mod this and turn it into a street sharks game. Remember that cartoon <laughs> and the figures? Who does? Oh, it? Be, if only. It would be pretty cool to include shark. it. If a street shark sprite was available, I'm pretty sure they would be in Cross Justice League. Yeah. All right. That stuff would be a Mugen so fast. Oh yeah. yeah. It's one of those cartoons everybody remembers because it's just a little bit weird. I more or less remember the toys because the commercials were on all the time when I was a kid. <laughs> yeah, I remember cable TV. You remember that, kids? Oh, there we go. Boom. Boom. Wow. You just got freaking Sangeeft right there. I wish. So, so he's a ninja robot who can wrestle. I think a Rat King is more the Zangief of this game, but he's a boss, so obviously banned from tournament play. Yeah, Zangief and that other character, Karai. Yeah, <laughs> we're gonna open up shenanigans on the next round. Karai has a one button in infinite, just so you know. <laughs> That's why we're opening up shenanigans. I know, I got to try her out and or him out. <laughs> That's uh, a Yeah, Karai's a lady. Yeah. Hmm, Chrome Dome. Mount Olympus. It seems like a, a normal. That wasn't. Oh, this, wait a minute. Hold on here. That's not George Washington. <laughs> there's Bebop and there's. Wait, Boston. I'm stupid. I'm the stupidest man alive. Ignore me, please. Okay, that's another thing. Why not Bebop or Rocksteady in this game? They would have been. Like, I could see Rocksteady being like a charge character. Oh my yeah. god, this got so crossed up, holy shit. It would be really cool if there was more characters in this and, game. And, and maybe Bebop playing something like Mr. Hart from Fist of the North Star fighting game. Got like a few generic we get foot infinite ninja. immediately and die. Yeah. Yeah, I remember that, dude. I've I, lo I love wacky. That game. I, I like that fighting game just because it's that wacky, you know? Yeah. Just like, it's, it's just a race to one touch your opponent as hard as you can. <laughs> then the Makes super, sense. 
that and some of the supers are fucking hilarious. Like you get the one with uh, Thouser, where he hits you, and all of a sudden a pyramid just appears under your under the opponent, and he throws a spear right out of nowhere, like in the anime. Is he killed one guy like that? So that has to be his ultimate for some reason. I'm bad. Oh, yeah. Ooh. JoJo Fridays are coming back, everybody. I'm excited. Yeah, we got Jolene coming in now. Uh, oh, yeah. Pressure, pressure. Oh, no. no get on the floor. <laughs> Never do the dinosaur. No, oh, fuck. They call, they call it doing the dinosaur because you're extinct now. <laughs> I can see killed that. Killed his mechanized version of himself and laughed about it. Who killed the dinosaurs? The Ice Age. Oh god. God. I actually have a VHS I copy. I think that's of two that for me. Uh, right. I think it's one one, isn't it? Or... Oh oh yeah yeah no 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 yeah, you're right yeah I'm so okay. I Tie took the first breaker. round. You took the this one. Tiebreaker like, time. Let's do it. I should go through the VHS tapes I have just to see what. Crap oh no, the mirrors. <laughs> It's like Sky Palace. That's where you want to fight. Technically, this is where that clone fight is. Perfect. No. I got I got Splinter held up there. Why is Splinter, it just the? Why? There we go. Enjoy some. Why nice is there just ooze? like an advertisement for like mutagenics Ooh. in the background? Enjoy, right. enjoy, enjoy a fresh can of mutagen right here. It has to be a reference to the ooze. Yeah. Yeah, but do you just like advertise that on a billboard? Like, come buy my shit. Like, that doesn't if, make sense. If, I bet if you could remove the life bar layer, it would probably there'd probably be like a, a a pull tab on that can, like it's a can of beer or something. See how it's covered up the lid. I also love the the weird the weird floaty background stuff going on. It's like you guys are in Colombia and Bioshock, and everything's just floating. Konami Columbia. advertising itself in the background too. Yep. Since 1969. Nice. <laughs> oh, they're not Six. good today, believe me. Yep. Great mutagen. Mmm. Yum. Okay, that color Raphael looks like the color of Raphael on a on a toy I used to have of him. I think that's the idea. But then if, that's another thing. Like I looked through it, like I know how some of the care some of the turtles have like different skin colors on the action figures, and like I don't think I've seen any of them besides this one in this game. Like I was expecting to see the brown Donatello. Like for some reason they made Donatello brown in the toys. <laughs> Oh my god, I could not get out. Let's kick shell. Let's kick shell. <laughs> Alright, it is time for shenanigans, Jojo. After one more? Or... Wait, is there another oh, one? I was gonna one say. more. One oh, more. Okay. He cuts Don't it off right it there. It's yet. the most disappointing thing ever. <laughs> <laughs> the most disappointing disconnect. <laughs> oh no. Is that a German also, suplex? No, no, what's the what's the billboard on the left advertising? Like toothpaste? Probably makeup? some beauty makeup material or something. It's just advertising that woman. That's it's it. advertising that woman. This woman is for sale. Oh boy, that sounded wrong. Is she a hooker? Okay. Ah, uh, this is. Yes. I never know if it's gonna cross up. God damn it. Yeah, <laughs> it does that. The trickiest goddamn move in the game. Fuck. Okay, now it's done. All right, now it's time for shenanigans. All right, so you want me to come in then? Yes. All right. And, and you'll see exactly what I'm doing as soon as you come in. We're gonna be using in. the bullshit boss characters, aren't we? Maybe. Okay. <laughs> I don't I don't think the bosses are enabled in this. Did did you check? They I, are. I, uh, I, the, I, I actually scrolled wrong. over and saw Karai, so Yeah, I was just yeah, saying you're already in here. Three, and there you go. Oh. The Brat King Karai, see? They're here. And oh. they all have uh, 12 colors too. Oh my god. All right. Hmm. You know what? Let's see. What the <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Someone sapped her colors away. What? 
Okay, I'm two player. Okay, all right. Let's see, Karai, purple, purple Karai, purple Karai again, gold Karai, green hair, anime Karai. Okay. This guy Two just looks like racking. he looks like Frankenstein, dude. Oh wow, he's got some cool colors. Yeah, wow. Racking, Racking has really good colors, actually. He juiced himself up for this game. Yes. <laughs> so he used to just be like a skinny little Vager, and now he's just like I'm Zangief now. I decided to bulk up for this tournament. Eating, eating all that sewer pizza really got him strong. Look at that! Look at this! Oh my God! What? That was and, uh... me pressing the A button. Look at that. That's just that's just an A button right there. That's just an A button. This is fucking axe kick. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yep. Karai mirrors should absolutely be a priority. Because then the game just becomes dive kick. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> okay, this is, this so is stupid. This is really <laughs> stupid. <laughs> Oh and man! That green rock steady is happy for me at least. <laughs> that is oh, okay. Oh, I asked for this, so I can't complain. <laughs> Holy shit! Look at this. Holy okay. Okay, on the next update, you no. gotta balance these guys somehow. <laughs> <laughs> no, it would, Let's have it would be uh, a luck with it, that. It would be it would be something for the uh, the update, but uh, ch I mean, trust me, these characters are are something that we care about. Like Rat King is in Cross Justice League as a completely new character with new animations and everything. No, come here. Oh. I like how he could do a I like how he could do a Kenshiro punch in the middle of the air, like. <laughs> <laughs> that is a weird sounding noise. <laughs> Sounds like he's puking. Well, that's the sound I make when I do drop kicks in the air. I mean, I don't know about you guys. <laughs> oh my god. Now oh, he's, he's on the stretch <laughs> to drop kicks. He's Air just Bailey from Dive Kick. kick. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is Ooh. Ah. You, have, you have to out bullshit the other. <laughs> wow. Cyber Rat King wins. Dude, his pecs are bigger than his head. Look at that. Dive Kiku. Oh, God. All right, I'm going to do it for the culture. And then I'm going to let you guys play with bosses, and then I think we'll be done. Alright. Is Rat King just grab a 360 or am I just insane? Uh, it's, it's half circle forward. Okay, good. I can do that better. <laughs> I'll try I'll try Rat King too, I guess. So let's nice see. Hagar. Good. He's uh, uh he's the best character in the game, so he's he's real good. Who Rat King? Yeah. Even better than Karai, huh? Yeah, I, I think Karai actually gets kind of destroyed by Rat King at the highest levels. Really? Hmm. Well, like I said, Rat King is just broken. Like, just <gasps> utterly broken. Every single option leads <laughs> oh to Oh my death. god! He's got a brain buster. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. What? You get a free you grab off these axe kicks. Oh you my god! You get a free god. command grab off of that. You get also you get a free... That is what we call case in point. Wow. If you, also get, if you also get a crouching roundhouse, that sets up uh, uh, another option. Like, you could literally just walk up, do crouching roundhouse over and over again, and if they block it, you can just command grab them for blocking it. Oh my god. Oh. Wow, these guys have no delay or anything between their moves. <laughs> no. They don't need it. The boss character's son? Privileged CPU bosses. What is going <laughs> on? You to death. <laughs> Every single time you block something on the ground and Rat King is like on the ground at the same time, free command grab. <laughs> oh, <laughs> thank God. <laughs> you should you should see what Rat King is like in uh, Cross Justice League. He's yeah. pretty cool. I got to get one round with this Rat King fella. Yes. He's so stupid. I, it's it's he's so stupid. I love it. Look at that. That's just one button I was doing all that from. One button. Just got the dive kicks. Oh god. Oh, what is going on? What what a hitbox? What, hit what, hit what a brain buster! Holy what shit! What boxes? All right. Not even hitboxes. They're hit zones. Yeah. 
I'm gonna let Hades and Rat Rat take over. All right, GG. Let me hold on a sec. Let me throw my cat out real quick. All right. Don't throw the cat, man. Come on, it's not cool. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. God. All right, he's just, here being, we go. He's, he's just being a menace, so. Oh my god. Yeah, one of these days we gotta do like a. Oh yeah. I gotta play NBA Jam with one of you guys and just make that a whole video of just an entire game. We did, and we played it before. Uh, I saw a really good. I don't yeah. think I was around for that. I was, oh, I don't that think color. I was around for that one. I don't think I was around for that one. We could probably play another session. I don't mind. Play fun games. Do it man. in the scrapyard. Oh, yeah. Well, like NFL Blitz or you know the other sports games. We could do I, those too. Was there ever like a hardcore soccer game in existence? Like an arcadey style soccer game? Maybe yeah, FIFA like... Street, but I don't know. Or, uh, I never played it. Oh my god. Um, the Coon, I think the I think yeah. the Cunio Coon games, like the River City Ransom series, I think they have a uh, I think they have a soccer game. Hmm. There's also Mega Man Soccer, which is just <laughs> fun if you don't give a shit. Oh my god, the Double Deuce is just light. It's just light punch. <laughs> oh my god, I can't do. I can't. I can't even. <laughs> Just press A until the game tells you to stop. That's how you play Rat King. Oh my god. Okay, I see it. Max kick and to just do my rock cat. You could just do sweep after that. Just do the rock cat kick and do a power bomb. It works every time. Standing roundhouse into crouching roundhouse combos. Almost oh always god. done. <laughs> what? So, so basically, basically, if you ever touch them, worst case scenario, they block it. You just command grab them. I <laughs> turned around one second. I turned around one second and the round was Do over. Do crouching roundhouse after that. Wow. Yes, there you go. No, I can't. Oh my god. <laughs> Scary, that is so insane. Much. So you, so you wonder if I think Karai is better than this? I don't know. <laughs> I take but it. This back. seems real good. I take That's it all pretty back. Pretty good. <laughs> oh, this gives me another idea. The Power Rangers <laughs> Super Nintendo fighting game. That one was uh, really good. I yeah. played the Genesis one. That one was uh, something. It's all right. The, the one I'm talking about is the one with, where you could play as the Zords. Yeah, they had that. They they had that in the Genesis too. Yeah, yeah I, right. I, I, this, one, this one was like the Thunder Megazord, the Ninja Megazord. The Genesis one was like the was like the original Dino Megazord. I mean, it was a good one. Don't get me wrong. Colors. It also, uh, can you guys hear me? Yeah. yeah. Can hear it, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I I just wanted to say I turned around for one second and then Rat King just completely dominated. <laughs> that's how. That's how. This great, man. I love that's it. That's how Rat King works. He's basically Dio Brando. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'll give Karai a shot. Round one. Really stick Never one had boy. the pleasure. Oh my god, no. Oh, here it comes. <laughs> Roda, Roda. It's, it's Dio versus Deodoro. It's Dio versus Deodoro. Oh Dio my god, I'm forward. Yo, yo, this is just, this is just what crouching. Do? What do you do? <laughs> <laughs> that's the yeah, question. Try a, um, try a back and light punch. Yeah, yeah, I think that's the one. Can light punch. Try heavy know. punch and heavy kick at the same time. Oh, that's right. Round two. Fight. That's right. Watch. Then you go. Whoop, oh. Whoop, whoop. Oh yeah, that's the infinite. <laughs> I can't. I cannot stay on the ground. Otherwise, I that will happen. No. You too. <laughs> just want to hide. These animation girls. No. Help me. Here, you can just. Being bullied. I don't like it. Okay. I didn't come here to go back to middle school. All right. <laughs> that was so stupid. Why do anything else? What was that Ford and heavy? Holy punch? shit! That was just back and light punch. <laughs> Back in light punch. Oh, All wow. day. You smash it. Now oh I see why God. these characters are banned. Now I see. Oh, Lord. <laughs> if you can yeah, believe it. True power. Armagon still does pretty good against Karai. <laughs> I believe it. You don't mind if I get around then? Uh, sure. You'll be the last one, Nero. 
Yeah, you can take my spot if he wants. Yeah. Alrighty. Good lord. Good times. <laughs> Insane. I've never I, seen I, I, anything I love like when fighting games are just dumb and broken. It's the best feeling in the world, man. Okay. I will knock myself down. Oh no, I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, no pink shredder. <laughs> it's not today. Uh, oh God, we haven't been to the Thunderdome all that much. Oh God, oh, this is going to be the most one-sided fight in the game. Right nope. here. Oh, this is the Thunderdome? This is the Thunderdome. It's a cool stage, I like it. It's like yeah, I got hair metal in the background. With, with dinosaurs and... Uh, it's the band uh, Limousine from Homestar Runner playing a yeah. gig. <laughs> we are Limousine! That's... Wait, is that... That's, that's, that's freaking Yuta from Fist of the North Star on the left. Look, it's Yuta! It's, it's nice to know after the apocalypse, he learned how to play a guitar. I mean... Look at him, it's Yuta! Okay, that just straight up beats Aura Crusher. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Insane. <laughs> Here we go. Well, listen, Sh Shredder might be the boss yeah, of the show, but just, the boss is... just flat out shits on Aura Crusher. Got it. <laughs> oh, oh wow. God. Like I said, most one-sided fight. I think Rackings smashed me I'm in my arcade I'm still winning by $100, playthrough. so it's all relative. Fight. <laughs> oh, you're looking at the score now. Okay, that's how that's how, okay. how you become an esports millionaire. You just beat up oh, other well, people and take their money. Well, that's how okay. Bitcoin works. Okay. Okay. One. Oh, oh, Brain just... Buster. Okay, I think I got an answer. It's the tiger knee. Oh, uh oh. Yep. Uh -oh. He found he found the small exhaust port on your Death Star. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I am the true villain and never forget it. You are a baby compared to me. You are all big babies. <laughs> okay, if someone wants to take my place, I'll welcome it. Uh, I'll do it. I guess I got nothing else to do. All right, this will be the last round. All right, I'm connecting. Let me get you in here. Okay, that's me. Oh my god, that was so much fun. The moment where you discover, okay, okay, that beat your little can cans crap. Let me just do that. Yeah, I'm gonna be honorable and not play as Rat King here. Honor in a fighting game? Ridiculous. Well, pick a turtle, because turtles fight with honor. Alright. Uh, okay, Flesh Tone Michelangelo, here we go. It's a cafeteria. There's lunch ladies back there serving tater tots. And apparently a cone head. Looks like the, one of the cone heads in the front there. <laughs> and a collie. Lassie's just in there for some reason. <laughs> Lassie's like, holy shit, I'm tripping here. Why aren't I a bipedal martial artist? This is bullshit. <laughs> He's got to assure you. He's Can't fuck with it. He, he, he's gonna bait that out, yeah. Yes! Oh, I found it! Look at him, you could put a dent in the ceiling with that guy's head there. <laughs> oh, attack. Oh, oh. Well, oh shit, Rainbuster. G goodbye, no. Jojo. Ow. <laughs> goodbye, Jojo. He got you in that corner, Infinite Loop. I Can't do anything about it. He put me in the corner. He's a master of this game. <laughs> There's a guy flipping a pancake back there over and over again. It's way more interesting than this fist fight between two mutants that's happening right now. Fist fight. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> you talk about Giuseppe in the background there flipping a pancake. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's 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 the guy from the Dingo Pictures movies. I don't know if you're familiar with those. Those like crappy PS2 want movies that yeah, they have. Fateless reviewed a couple it's, times. It's, it's done. No, no! <laughs> God! <laughs> God fuck Rat King, man. Fuck this guy. Alright, that is it for our session today.
We're gonna sign fun. out. That was fun. That was Great cool. fun. Good times. I hope y'all will at some point try out TMNT Cross Justice League. I mean, it's four players, so it's it's probably one of those games you could get together and like make two teams or something like that. It, it would be good. Ooh.